It is time to bring forward a deck like no other. It is time to showcase you the power of a free-to-play deck. It's time for my test with the almighty Blue Eyes White Dragon. Without further ado, let us proceed. First of all, I'm gonna showcase you guys the amazing deck the, uh, that we're gonna have. It. Okay, I got, I got, I got, I kind of forgot about you, so we're gonna go ahead and open it together. Um, yeah, why not, bro? Why not? Okay, cool. What should we pull? What should we pull, bro? What should we pull, bro? Oh, this one you're saying? Okay, cool, bro. Yeah, I, I, I was, I was with that too. Oh, absolutely! Absolutely, bro. The power of blue eyes is within our heart today. And with a bonus pack. Hold up now, because I'm not hearing perfectly. All right, cool. One, two, three. Eye, eye, eyes of vision with eyes of blue. I like that. I like that. Kaiba! Now, let's see. This one card. What should we pull, y'all? I'm feeling Black Luster Link, bro. For some reason, I'm feeling Black Luster Link. Let's pull it off, bro. Oh my god! Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragon! Oh my lord, bro. Is this how, is this how we're gonna start off? We're gonna start off like this. Ain't we? All right, we've added the new Blue Eyes Alternate White Dragon in uh, the deck. And ladies and gentlemen, this is the Blue Eyes Max deck. A deck that I have created with so much passion and so much thought in the process. I wanted to make it, as I said in the previous video, which if you haven't seen, we showcase in the second anniversary. I'm gonna leave it down in the description down below. Down twice. We go with it. Uh, first of all, we're gonna be playing with three Blue Eyes White Dragons. As always, you know, it's a Blue Eyes White Dragon deck, so we might as well have three copies of the Ultimate Beast. Um, then we're gonna be having two White Stone of Legends and two White Stone of Ancients. The reason that I'll be playing two White Stone of Legends and two White Stone of Ancients is because uh, it uh, do, does a really great combo with Sage with Eyes of Blue which you can actually bring forward uh, one light uh, tuner, I believe. Yes, one light uh, level one tuner uh, from your deck to your hands. Then I'm playing Maiden. So now listen, why the reason why I'm playing Maiden is because it's a secret, really nice combo that Maiden is doing that I'm going to showcase you in our duos that is doing with Mausoleum of White. With Mausoleum of White does, I'm gonna explain uh, in the duo, so uh, we're not gonna waste any more time here. I'm playing three Dictator Ds, one Alternative, one Abyss, um, one Jet Dragon, one Deep Eyes. You can up, uh, if you don't wanna play with Deep Eyes, you can, if, like, you know, cool. Chaos Max, um, one Polymerization, three Ultimate Fusions, Two tradings, two melodies, two dragon shrines, uh, one return of the dragon lords. I personally like return of the dragon lords because it's a form of monster reborn. Plus, in a battle phase, if your monster is going to be destroyed, you can uh, negate that. Uh, you can uh, stop your monster by being destroyed by removing from play uh, return of the dragon lords, uh, basically from banishing. One chaos uh, form, two summon chaos max, three ultimate fusions. And then we're playing Infinite Impermanence, True Light, and the Ultimate Creature of Distraction. Now, the only uh, things that I have added to this free-to-play deck is um, two Ash Blossoms that you can actually get guaranteed from the Master Packs alongside with the two Infinite Impermanence that you can also get from the Master Packs. And then the only other thing that I have added is... Um, Neo Blue Eyes Ultimate uh, White Dragon. No, it's Neo Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. And one Blue Eyes Spirit. Because basically we can... Uh, I don't remember if actually Spirit is in the... Um, in the structure deck. I do not remember right now. But either way, 
I have added these cards that you can actually get really early into the game. Plus one, uh, no, erratic. No, I think we got it. Yeah, we got it erratic uh, from pulling in the second anniversary. That's why I put him in as well. And one piece that you also get from the deck. So with that being said, now that we, uh, yeah, save. Now that we showcase the deck, let's go right in. Oh my God, I didn't see my hand. Chaos Max. First draw? So, from what I'm seeing... With me. Dude. So, from what I'm seeing... Oh my god, bro. Talking about Spiffy. Alright, bro. First, I activate my... No, should I activate? No, I'm gonna I'm gonna summon Sage with Eyes of Blue first. Yep. To see if he has anything uh, uh, on him, like a, an Ash or something like that. So what I'm gonna do... Um, wait, let me check my hand. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna bring a Maiden. I'm gonna bring a Maiden in my hand. Uh, so, what I can do right now is activate Dictator of D. And I'm gonna send Blue Eyes into the graveyard, the one that I have on my deck. I'm gonna then activate Trading. Yes, sir. To throw the second one, drawing two cards. Okay. Hmm. Then I'm gonna activate Dictator D's uh, effect. Uh, and I'm gonna discard one Blue Eyes to Special Summon. The blue eyes. White dragon. <laughs> and that allows me to draw another one. And the last blue eyes white dragon from my deck. Now, in this occasion, if I had drew ultimate fusion, it would have been a wrap for me to basically, you know, bring forward my boy. But uh, it's all right. It's all right. What we can do right now is limit our opponent by leaving spirit down i could actually bring silver as well protecting the field and stuff like that but i can actually leave the field like that and protect yeah yeah i'm, 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 I'm gonna do that i'm gonna do that i'm gonna do that we're basically limiting our opponent to maximum of two special summons which is really nice if you ask me uh, wait, what? Uh -huh. oh. And now we're playing against Snake Eyes, which is the newest and top tier deck. But our opponent right here made a grave mistake. Because not only his monster, the zombie plug something, is negated, the Snake Eyes behind him is also because he placed him in the same row. And in the same row as my face down card. So let's see. Actually, that's a really crispy. Because Blue Eyes White Dragon deck. The Blue Eyes White Dragon deck that I'm playing right now. Is not to the maximum power that I can. You know. That I have in mind what I'm going to do. To, to maximize its efficiency. But it's really great. Hmm? It's really great to actually uh, play against Snake Eyes and see how a free-to-play deck is faring against, against the top-tier deck, basically. Mm -hmm. So I'm guessing he's gonna do some kind of effect. Oh, he's not. Okay, yeah, he can. End phase. All right. Um, yeah, I think now... Wait... I'm gonna summon Maiden. I think now I can. Okay. Boom. Spawn. Oh! Wait, what? What? Why did that happen? No monsters on the field and in the graveyard become zombie monsters. Neither play can tribute monsters except zombie monsters? On God? 
We cannot tribute someone, yo. This is this is actually getting really interesting. This is actually getting really interesting right now. So you can discard this card and target one effect monster you control, send it to the graveyard, and if you do, special summon one blue eyes monster from your deck. Do I have another blue eyes? I might have wait. Yes, activating maiden's effect. Nice. Special summon from the graveyard. My boy Blue Eyes. And now... Oh! Oh! Wait a minute! Oh, wait a minute. I'm, I'm, I think I'm gonna bring Jet Dragon instead of Abyss. Because with Jet Dragon I have... A secure play field, which is actually a lot more efficient right now. You feel me? So, let me check. I can also bring in Erratic. Ooh, entrepreneur, you can detach one material from this card, tribute any number of monsters from your hand and or field, then destroy equal. Oh, shit. Mmm. I mean, listen. Listen, the only reason that I'm bringing Nier at it right now, all right, is because I do not know. I, I want to get rid of uh, his uh, his snake eyes and his field, basically. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to detach. Um, I'm going to detach one blue eyes, yes. And then I'm going to target Dictator. And Sage, I decided. And then, I'm gonna tribute this and this. Nice, bro. And then I'm gonna, uh, and then I'm gonna attack with Jet, activating Jet's effect, getting rid of that. Oh, oh, she cannot attack. Oh, my bad, bro. Oh, my bad. I, I did. I, okay, my bad, bro. I did not. I did not remember Jet's effect has that. Uh, you cannot attack in the same turn. But it's cool. It's cool. It's cool. Let's see. All right. An interesting combo. An interesting way in turn of events, if I must say. Bro. And remember, we're not playing uh, inside with uh, Cold by the Grave. We're not playing with uh, Maxi. We're not playing with Bestials. We're not playing with. Uh, um, uh, branded fusion. We're not playing with like. We're not playing with Lubelian. We're not playing with Jet Sincon Baronet. Like we have a lot of cards that we're not putting into the deck, keeping it free to play. I'm just reminding y'all, bro. All right, all right. Yes. Oh, okay, okay. Melody. I like that. Melody says this got one card, which is actually really cool. Okay. I'm activate blue eyes jet dragon effect. Ooh. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna get rid of his uh, trap card. Yeah, you can. Oosh! Are we about to defeat Snake Eyes, bro? If that's the case, bro, I have already proven my point. If that's the case, I have already proven my point about this deck, bro. All right. Make your last pathetic move, Ryan. Wow. His name is Ryan. That's why I'm saying, okay. Expected. He's debating on whether or not he's going to put the trap card down because he knows Jet Dragon's effect right now. And he's not going to put it down. Buddy, you lost. Draw! Oh, my lord. All right, bro. 
Listen. I'ma activate the melody of a waking dragon. I'm gonna discard Deep Eyes White Dragon. And I will get to my hand. Yeah, I cannot use either of them. Oof. Okay. But. Hear me out. Activating my beautiful Eratic Overlord uh, Dragon effect. I'm gonna discard Blue Eyes White Dragon. And I'm gonna discard bro both Chaos Max and Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragon from my hand. Allow me to destroy both of my opponent cards, leaving him for a direct attack. If this card is sent to the grave, you can special someone dragon type monster from your what? Uh, from your hand, okay. Oh, he's playing with blue eyes, solid dragon, okay. You can target one monster your opponent controls. Good luck with that. Yeah, good luck with that, bro. Jet Dragon, boy! Do your homework next time. You fool. I attack with Blue Eyes Jet Dragon, and I activate his effect once more, returning your pathetic card into your hand, leaving you playing field for an erratic Sand Dragon Overlord attack, directing your life. <laughs> we made our point. We just defeated a snake eyes deck. I'm just gonna say that. We battle in Shuki! Oh my lord, bro. Now 1v, bro. Now 1v. Yugi, Dark Magician, gonna pull up someone, bro. You know what I mean? With me. Duel! Oh, shit. And we have the whole... We have the whole field! Oh, my God, bro. All right. And we have Ultimate Fusion on us. Okay. I'm gonna activate Dictator D. Throwing one blue eyes white dragon into the graveyard. Sending. Putting Dictator of with Special Summoning in defense position. And I'm gonna. Mm, no. I'm gonna activate Dictator D effect so that I can send the white stone of a legend to the graveyard. Special summoning one blue eyes white dragon from my graveyard. And therefore, activating the White Stone of Legends effect from the graveyard to bring me a Blue Eyes White Dragon direct from my deck to my hand. <laughs> now, you may do your pathetic move. Not gonna lie, yo. Not, I'm, not, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. Sometimes. When I'm dueling by myself like like that, chilling with some music, you know, playing in the background, probably with a theme deck, like, I don't know, hacking theme from Shadow Kaiba, stuff like that. Usually the music that I'm putting on the, uh, in, the in the vids is the music that I also hear when I'm playing Yu-Gi-Oh! So this is how I be sometimes, bro. This is how I be. You feel me? Like, a, a, a you straight up capping if you say that you are not like that, bro. You straight up capping. I'm, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Please attack me, you worthless cold. Oh! No. Okay, I'm not gonna do that. <clears throat> Blaster Dragon. I hope my opponent has done their homework this time. <laughs> you may try to attack the Tater of D and walk direct into my trap. I'm waiting. My patience is wearing thin. You may attack the Tater of D. <laughs> now, Blue Eyes White Dragon destroyed his Luster Dragon. And because that happened, 
I bring forward Blue Eyes Jet Dragon. You see, what my opponent failed to see right here is dictator of this secret effect. If Dictator D has a Blue Eyes White Dragon in the field, he gets to decide who is gonna attack in which target of my cards. And thus, I picked Blue Eyes White Dragon, destroying his Luster Dragon. <laughs> Actually, there is no reason to overdrive that. I could just finish him off right here and there, basically. So that's what I'm gonna do, unless he has a a trap card. Dictator of D, attack his life points directly. He's gonna allow that to make me to feel to to make me feel like okay, I'm I'm good. Blue eyed red dragon, attack his life points directly. Distraction. <laughs> Don't you know that we're gonna both lose 3,000, you fool? <laughs> ah. No, I don't need to. He tried. He tried to. He tried to target my blue eyes white dragon to do the ring of destruction, not knowing the blue eyes jet dragon effect that he's basically an azure. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Let me. Yeah. Let me. Let me show you the guy. He's basically an azure. I see the dragon, bro. From like every turn. And now for the grand finale, blue eyes white dragon attacking life force directly. <laughs> and that, ladies and gentlemen, is just a free-to-play deck with the almighty beast knowing as Blue Eyes White Dragon. No. Oh. Oh, I forgot to say duel, my bad. I actually I actually have a burn in my hand. I burned the other day my hand. A small piece of it. Uh it's it's cool right now, you know, it's uh yeah. when I when I burned myself it wasn't cool. Yeah. How are you doing, bro? You doing great? I, I, you know I didn't ask you. I keep forgetting sometimes. My bad. Dictator of D. Draw. Oh, oh. Spiffy. First of all, let me put infinite impermanence. Then, what I'm gonna do is gonna. I'm gonna summon Maiden with Eyes of Blue right here. What you gonna do, bro? Have a trap hole? <laughs> Come on, Stella, my patience is wearing thin. Ring of distraction, bro. On Maiden, please. Don't be so pathetic. Maiden, activate your effect and call upon the mighty beast, Blue Eyes, White Dragon. Pathetic move. From a pathetic duelist like yourself, Stella. Wow! <laughs> Thank you, Maiden. Of your service. Shall I continue? Thank you. I activate Dictator of D. Sending one of my blue eyes from my hand to my graveyard to special summon him. You might as well play Waboku next time, bro. Dictator of D in defense position. And now, I shall activate Dictator of D's effect. Throwing the third Blue Eyes White Dragon from my hand to my graveyard to special summon him into the field. And now, no. I'm gonna save my room. Stella. 
Still, I may not be able to attack this turn. But make sure that this draw will be your last. Ho, oh, oh, ho, brother, ho, oh, oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, ho, now. You got too much dip on your chill. Listen, bro, if you cringe, you may go. This is how I be when I'm playing Yu-Gi-Oh, bro. This is a special type of hits for me, bro. I'm just, it's, it's like, I'm sharing this with you, bro. I'm, I'm, I'm like expressing myself. I want you to know that fully, to the maximum. I'm not, for the maximum of hits. I'm, I'm, I'm not hiding a shit, bro. I'm keeping it real with you, bro. Let me draw an ultimate fusion and you shall know disaster. Oh, Sage with eyes are blocking. All right, so listen. You can discard this card, then target one effect monster you control, send it to the graveyard, and if you do special summon. Ah. Oh, say life. I send Sage with eyes are blue in the graveyard, targeting Dictator of D for my field. Oh no, I not, right now I cannot do. Okay, cool. I will not need the reveal of Rhapsody. I'll wait some phone. To bring forward. Bro, I just love Blue Eyes Jet Dragon, bro. I wanna do one for Chaos Max, but like I wanna keep it, I wanna keep it for real. You feel me? I wanna keep it for real. Now the field is locked. I might as well draw a true light and, and this is it. Like you feel me? And we haven't even drawn true light. Stella, you have won one more round for yourself. You may draw your last pathetic card from your pathetic deck. I mean, what type of deck is built only in hiding behind your pathetic monsters and trap cards, buying you turn after turn so that you can draw and delay your demise? <laughs> I know that I could attack with Jet Dragon, I forgot. I'm too busy. I'm too busy throwing antagonist. Oh, do I want to do that? Yeah, fuck that, bro. You found to do shit, Stella. Change your deck, boy. Yep. Look at her leaving, bro. She gonna be. Oh, fuck that. Out F O. You know what I mean? <laughs> Draw. Ultimate fuel. Okay. So, by doing Melody right now... Oh! Oh, yes, sir! Absolutely! Absolutely Melody of Awakening! I activate the Melody of Awakening Dragon to discard one card from my hand, and that will be Dragon Revival Rhapsody to bring forward... Where is my... Where is... What? Where is my third blue eyes? Oh, that... Okay, bro. I didn't see I had two blue eyes. Okay, bro. Chill, it's cool. Okay, I could still bring... Listen, what I could do again is... I could basically bring still Erratic with Jet Dragon and, like, finish it off. But I want to go more traditional, bro. All right? So, let's go. Blue Eyes White Dragon attack! His monster, the Dark Tech Ceiling. Sealed. Well, he's about to be in Ceiling, bro. With White Lightning! You're going to stop my attack. I'm eager to see how. Yeah. What am I? What? Yes. Take that up to your hand, bro. Blue Eyes White Dragon attack! Stella, you have one more pathetic turn. Draw your last pathetic card. And let's end this miserable duel. You might as well surrender if you like. I mean, save yourself from further humiliation. Should I bring in a, an erratic in the field and destroy her cards? That would be devastating for her, bro. 
All right, let's do it. <laughs> oh my god, bro. Started this episode as a set of Kaiba my feelings you like Mary, bro. <laughs> oh my god, bro. All right, let me activate my effect, bro. Yep. Yes, sir. And now, one, two, three, four of your cards. And I target all of your trap and spell cards. <laughs> and now I'm gonna activate Sage with Azure Blue effect. Send here, Erratic back. Thank you, Erratic. Of your service. Select a monster special summon from your deck. And I'm gonna be and I'm gonna bring my boy Abyss on the field, bro. Yep. No. Polymerization. What? I'm gonna do a polymerization right now, bro. See? <laughs> okay. Yeah, right. Okay, bro. Let me finish the duel, bro. That was it. That was it, bro. Okay. Let's 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 okay, blue eyes abyss dragon. Attack him with white lightning! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, that was it for today. I hope you enjoyed the amazing uh, free-to-play deck that we have created. I honestly wanted to put as uh, low of expense cards in the deck as possible and as best in a combo mechanic and blue eyes themed as possible. Unfortunately, I could not showcase you the Mausoleum of White with the Maiden effect and the Ultimate Fusion, but again, it's cool because that means that you can make the deck, go back in the intro, make the deck, and experience this yourself by buying the structure deck from the shop. Right? This one right here, that is basically giving you almost every card that I have put into the deck, right? It gives you Blue Eyes, Alternative, a Beast, Jet Dragon, uh, Sage, Dictator of D. It gives you uh, one pair of the eggs. It gives you a Maiden, a Melody of Awakening. Um, it gives you one a Return of the Dragon, o Dragon Lords, Chaos Form. It gives you tons of cards, Ultimate Fusion, Polymerization. It gives you tons of cards. No, it doesn't give you trading. I've added that as well. Uh, but as a beginning account, that you want to make a deck and uh, like you don't know where to start and stuff like that buying those structure decks times three that the shop allows you plus spending your ur on the cards that i have added like trading spirit azul azul doesn't even need urs it needs secret rare basically and adding the fusion as well your deck is gonna be top tier and i've proven that in this video by basically beating snake eyes bro like my job is done, boy. My job is done, eh? I finished that, bro. Come on now. All right, bro. I'm out of here. I'm out of this bitch, bro. Guys, thank you all for being here. I love you. And as always, I'm going to see you in the next piece, bro. Be truthful. Be you and do you, bro. And as always, Shogun is out. I want to see you down in the comments below telling me that you have annihilated your pathetic opponents after you made this deck. Thank you all for being here. I love you. And... Cha! Think I take your words? Like you thought I was not gonna say that.